Welcome guys. In this video, I'm making this video as an overview and an introduction to the course. And yeah, we have a course that's actually running already. And in this video, I want to explain some stuff and also we are going to make some quick, quick trick with jQuery, with PHP, not jQuery. So yeah, generally what we have is this. So everything that is here is tackled in the course. Yeah, so this just saves data automatically without it having to click the publish button. And we have some customizations here. We have Gantt charts, calendar, auto populate, uh, auto update, news. We have jQuery customizations here and many other more you get. We also have uh, sending emails. So when you uh, when you join the course, these are some of the stuff you are going to get. And whenever we finish, the, when you finish the course, you get this project right below there so that you can actually have to, you can use it as a reference. Everything is, uh, is handled here. And uh, all you just need to do is just copy and paste it to your project and you're good to go. So we have the calendar here. So this is just some basic calendars. Let me just show you. And so this calendar you can go to the file where you see it from. You work you worked with. Also we have the Gantt charts here. And in every in every area where you need something some code might be needed, you might you will get the code there on how to do it. This is how you get the code it's just commented you can copy paste it and work with it also this is a course you can get the code from add with the .com. i'll link at the bottom there and uh let's get on with it we need something uh, interesting right now what we want to make right now we want to make a image gallery from a folder not uploading from a using php so go ahead and create a new section and you need to make this a md12 so that it actually fits uh, the screen okay rest wait for it to reload and what i'll be using is i'll be using a file i already have here inside my root folder of the project i'll be using this file called iconics which has all these icons and so let's go back here and in the section we just created let's draw a custom view inside this custom view just delete this we don't need it open it and let's get down to business so let's open php like that and we create a, a path to our images so it's just going to be a, a a string and you're going to say iconic slash then close that all right all right come on all right all right let me just do that and we need to do now the next thing we need to do here we need to create another variable that will contain our files maybe we can say files all uh, yeah we say files uh, we're going to do a globe and inside there we are going to pass two parameters the two par parameters will be our path then the next thing we need to do is we need to just concatenate that and next thing we need to do is this and so we need to put this inside an array so that we can have several and inside here you need to just define what you need so in my case that will be png png in case you need uh, a jpg you just pass in jpg like that and yeah so the next thing you need to do is you need to pass in a globe Pass in grub brace, yeah, like that. Uh -huh. We might be having all right, just 
going to continue it there. So the next thing now you need to do is we need to loop through this. So we do a for each, and you're going to say these files as file like that. And instead here we need to do a call. We're going to pass in img source is equals to so we're going to do source is equals to and you need to concatenate here and you need to pass this variable that we put here which is and file like that then you just need to close that close it from here that from here in close php so let's save that but first of all let's confirm we have no errors yeah 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 now let's reload and see what we get Oh, it's taking a lot of time to load, but let's wait, it's worth it. And there we go. Awesome. So we have that and uh, yeah. So we have our images displaying right about here. So that will be it for these guys. And if you need the course, just use the link in the description below. And see you in the next video.